Hey everybody, and welcome back to our playthrough of XCOM Chimera Squad. So, the team here is all assembled. We are about to roll out to... Uh, we're going to cover a... Bomb, stop a bomb? No, we're going to say a hostage in Highland Square, which should bring down unrest and give us a new field team. That will be good. I was thinking, before we go, I am going to buy something, because we have a little bit of money saved up. And I'm thinking we're going to get some extra padding again, because now we can start putting uh, enhancements on people's armor. And I think uh, we're going to put this on Godmother, because she is up in the fray. She's got a shotgun. Did we not purchase that? That's strange. Oh, that was the weapon thing. Okay, extra padding. My bad. Those are weapon enhancements. We have one armor enhancement. And we are good to go. So, we are taking Terminal, Blue Blood, Godmother, and Axiom again. Let's roll. Friendly VIP is definitely here. Alright, reach mode. So we have four, four breach points, and this is good. They all have positive things. Reflex boost. Okay, 25 defense, some extra mobility, good visibility there, so that's extra aim. All right. All units through this entrance get one dodge. So how do we want to do this? Let's have... Uh, Axiom go through here since he soaks up a lot of damage. We'll get some extra defense for him. Let's have Terminal get the extra movement. Extra aim. Uh, let's give that to Godmother. Blue Blood already has great aim. And let's give Blue Blood the extra dodge because he's got pretty low dodge because he has that scar we have not removed. So, into the breach. Okay, so we got a guy over there, 77. Ooh, no one on this side has really good... No one has a really good shot on anybody, do we? Uh, that guy... Let, let's take the 64. It's not great, but... There we go. We'll take it. Okay. 93 is very good. Let's go for the 93 hurt but he's not down okay godmother we could finish off that guy or that guy let's go for that guy kill him outright and then blue blood here uh let's finish off this guy completely okay looks like actually we only killed one outright those two there are basically on death's door. Oh, okay. In some sort of mental link with each other. I wonder what that's about. Collect evidence. Okay, so we have some bonus objective there. Axiom is up first. Who's the first one in the turn order? Bella. So let's psych up. Who wants some? We're gonna run in and subdue. Take him right out of the game. Alright, number two is that guy in the back. Don't really have... Oh! Right, we have our new ability for her. Pin down, I forgot we had that. Now, we don't really need it right now. Let's see, four, let's take it. Awesome, okay. Then Godmother is up, and this is the next number two person. We pretty much cleared out this side, so let's go Come ahead and move up without fear. I think we should be able to take him out. Oh, maybe not quite. Might not have been the best here. Oh, okay. Nope, we got a critical. Excellent. Okay. Now, Blue Blood could take that guy out on his next turn. 
Or he could maybe even take him out this turn. Let's not... Let's not do that yet, because I want to try and get that contraband. So, we're going to let this guy take a turn. I'm going to move Blue Blood over here to kind of get in a better Stepping spot, out. maybe, for next turn. Because my plan is... Uh, have him hunker down in preparation. Okay. Oh, okay, he's gonna zip zap over that way. Go on, get out of here. Be silent. No lance. Oh. Okay, I'm glad you decided to only use that on one person. Jeez. All right. So let's have blue blood. Uh, or not blue blood. Let's have Axiom run up here. And we'll take the contraband. And can we subdue this person? Looks like we can do this. Subdue the target. Bottle lightning. I'll put that achievement is for. Alright. Damage likely. Overseer. La uh, last unit through the entrance automatically receives Overwatch. Okay, that is good. So what I think we're going to do is let's send Axiom through first again. And... Terminal... Uh, now, hang on a minute. We got to... Okay. Unit is not injured. Maybe I need to... Uh, I'm just trying to get her her thing that we want uh, elected there. So I'm gonna put maybe I have to put everyone in place first, then refresh. Okay, so we're gonna do this. Actually, you know what? No, let's put terminal um, at the end here because oh, I guess it doesn't particularly matter. I was gonna say they won't go until after we've gone. I was thinking this way she could heal anyone that gets damaged as we go through. But let's still hit refresh. Um, do that. Everyone else just has normal breach fire. And here we go. Behind me. Okay, so we've got an 88 on him. 80 on this guy. He's aggressive. Take him out now. Alright, put him down. The seven again. Yep, might as well go for. Might as well go for that one. Eighty percent on that guy back there. He is a hardy one, a sorcerer. Okay. Uh, but he's got a lot of health, so we might be better off shooting at one of these guys here. Seventy-three. Let's go for that guy. He's in a little bit of cover, so we'll use our uh, special ability there. All right, and maybe Terminal can take out this guy that's right Oh, okay, not quite. He is wounded, but he'll probably be able to get a good shot on one of us. VIP in sight. Get that hostage to safety. Interesting. Okay, this is cool. The VIP is actually an alien. So, okay, we got Axiom here, and who is next in the turn thing? This guy. So why don't we let's psych him up. up? Come on, buddy, get pumped. And do we want to subdue or we could probably subdue? Yes, let's subdue him. Stop wiggling. You're caught. <laughs> All right. Good. So then, uh. Godmother. I keep wanting to call her Mother Goose for some reason. Um, he's next. Let's see. There's a guy down there who could easily flank us if we go here. We should be able to get a decent shot on this trooper just from this spot. Oh, really? 41? Why is it so bad? He's right in front of us. Oh, well. Doesn't matter. Okay. Blue blood is up. Nice. That guy is out in the open. So let's do... Since we don't have to move, we can... Oh! 
<laughs> okay, we get two shots at him, though. And I guess for this next one, let's do a Deadeye shot. Maybe we can kill him with this one. There we go. Okay. You must go. That was lucky. All right. Now we can't really. I don't want to group everyone up because I don't know what kind of abilities this sorceress or sorcerer or whatever they are have. Um. Hmm. Where do I want to put? You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna go into Overwatch here. Yes. Try and keep that one pinned down. And okay, let's psych him up. Ready for action. We're gonna move in. Smash. Come in from this Dragon side. Skulls. Kind of limit where she can run to. Right. Godmother here. Move her in a little bit. Keep her in cover. 60. Let's take it. Ooh. Don't shoot Axiom. Uh, 51. Move the blue blood Eyes back. Open. Back here. And hopefully we can get a shot off. You restore us. Oh, okay, she's got like a health steal. Oh, he did not like that, though. Okay, he didn't go into a, into a rage like I expected, though. All right, well, let's cast Safeguard on Axiom. On Get him healed up a little bit. We'll just move up a little bit. Maybe we can get a good shot on that sorcerer if she's still around by the turn. Which she probably won't be. Um, got her kind of... Got her no back ammo. against the wall here. Moving. Uh, actually, let's subdue her. We can. Guaranteed damage Master, there. Subdued. All right, and Blue Blood, we'll just move you over here. See anything about reinforcements inbound? I don't see where we're going to need to potentially extract this VIP to, so it's all just bunched together for now. Got your back. And Axiom, go get the snake. Okay, there are reinforcements coming in. Right there, and... Uh, oh, back there, okay. We got a couple of turns. Looks like the snake's gonna be able to move again before the reinforcements get here, so that is good. Let's... Uh, Anything that moves. Axiom on Overwatch I'm there. We low. probably could have just started him. Uh, okay. Changing position. Let's get Godmother get here, on. and we'll put her in Overwatch. Uh, maybe uh, the same spot. We'll do the same Covering spot with her. Zone. Got a shotgun. Got this. Let's get Blue Blood. Have him go over Headed here. He'll Never overwatch this entrance. Pretty much the whole distance. And terminal, we can move back and, and put her on the same one. I'll shoot at anything that moves. They won't get the drop on us. All right, let's get the VIP out of the room. And then all the reinforcements should come in after that, and hopefully we can just gun them down. Oh. Heading out. Low on ammo. Not a huge number of reinforcements, actually. 
Okay, so we're gonna move. Let's have Axiom start moving towards the door since he's the farthest away. Ammo out. We'll just uh, have Godmother do him. Got some more reinforcements coming in here in a minute. Uh, let's see, seventy percent. Get on the other side of this wall here. Sixty-eight. We'll still take that. Okay, cool. He's gunned down. Well, let's go Gotta ahead and start extracting our people. We'll send Terminal out first. Almost dry. A couple more reinforcements are coming in. I'm not really worried about them at all. No one ammo. Try and do that. Incoming. Move Axiom here. That guy's probably going to take a shot, but he'll be out of here before he really gets the chance. Cover me while I reload. Uh. On the move. Watch your angles. Ripper 2 might get a shot at Blue Blood, but I don't think he's going to... Oh, he's going to pull back. Interesting. He's going for the obvious flank. I'm well, I guess we are playing this on normal. That's all right. I'm not going to complain about him uh, not shooting us. All right, excellent. Yeah, we did. We probably got some intel for taking uh, down a certain number of guys. I was researching, I guess, uh, each person you subdue increases the chances by 20% of you getting some extra intel. So if you get at least 5, then we get 100% uh, for extra intel. So there we go, we got 20 extra intel. Got some Illyrium. We have a new field team, and we reduced unrep. Oh, and Cherub completed his basic training. Great. I have more background on the insurgents behind the mayor's attack. Just after the war, City 31 reached out to nearby resistance networks to help keep the peace. The insurgents belonged to a cell in the Shrike network. That network provided security before 31PD existed. They left when the Global Council cleared aliens and hybrids for return to society. Mm, couldn't stomach protecting the people they fought in the war? Seems that way. Since 2037, they've kept to the outskirts and swapped war stories at their watering holes. Sounds like a dead end. Maybe. Something drove them to carry out this attack. Keep your eyes open. Interesting. Okay. We got a little bit more information on them here. Maybe that means that ability will be available. 31 PD arrested two humans and a sectoid for removing their dampeners at the promenade. The arresting officer downplayed the psionic disturbance. This was a political demonstration that got out of hand. Nothing more. A protester on the scene disagreed. The dampeners are painful. We should be able to live as naturally as anyone else. Celio Dash reporting for Channel 37. Hmm. Okay, so I'm going to send uh, Blue Blood over here to uh, have his scar taken care of. That'll take two days. Uh, it looked as though we had some other promotions here in the locker room. So let's see here. Okay. Godmother has one. He now can choose between last stand. Godmother is unimpaired and takes enough damage to begin bleeding out there. Instead, uh, reduce to one HP and give her a turn immediately after the current turn. Well, once permission. Okay, so she can resist death and maybe move to cover or something. That is quite good. Um, flush. Godmother takes a shot at an enemy, forcing them to reposition. The shot does no damage. Has a one-turn cooldown. Okay. Hmm. I think I'm going to go for flush. There's been a lot of times... Because flanking is... Uh, we don't have as much movement in this one, and we don't have any grenades yet. There's really no way to get people out of cover. And so it would be nice... 
uh, to have something that could do that. All right, Axiom, my man, he's got something as well. Battering Ram, burst through the door at a breach point with a chance to panic nearby enemy. Okay. Panic chance increased with rage. Okay, very cool. So that's something we probably want to use on later breaches after he's kind of built that up a bit. Awesome. What else do we got going? One more day till we have improved field teams. And uh, Verge is doing that, getting us some Illyrium there. That's good. Uh, Blue Blood's training. Oh, we haven't read a biography. Um, read about Blue Blood. I'm kind of curious. All right, Blue Blood. Old word origin. United States of America. Prior to invasion, only child of a teacher and a third generation police officer. Oh, he's a... That, that explains the name. He's a cop. Uh, 2015 invasion. Fled initial attacks with his father. Eventually sent to a relocation camp at nine years old. 2016 to 2034 occupation. Relocated to City 31 with his family. Apprenticed with his father's private detective agency. Solving issues for an undeserved or underserved portion of the city. Gained a positive reputation and learned the basics of investigative. 2035 War for Liberation. Smuggled hundreds of people out of City 31 whom Advent had labeled as dissidents only some of whom were actual resistance members. 29 years old. Present. Joined 31 uh, PD in its inception and served with distinction. Left 31 PD for the Reclamation Agency uh, with blessing of former 31, TB, uh, 31 PD Commissioner uh, Markham, deceased. Uh, his investigative background is an asset to Camara Squad. Okay, so, so, yep, former cop. Former cop who looks a little bit like Samuel L. Jackson. Very cool. Very cool. So we got him. Let's take a look at our supplies here. Anything we want to buy. We don't have a lot of credits. We might be able to afford a stock or an autoloader or something. I think at this point, maybe we'll just hold on to our money a little bit longer. Uh, we could get extra padding. Extra padding is always nice. I like that HP. Let's do that. Let's give someone else a little extra extra help. So, okay. Agent's idle. Cherub is back. Let's put him back in our main group here. And I think with that, we are ready to check the map out. So, we have a situation going on. Choose from. So that's great. Let's do those because those happen instantly. This one gives intel, dismantle an Illyrium smuggling ring. Okay. Uh, we are getting a little short on intel. This one gives more Illyrium. Uh, let's do the intel one, and let's uh, uh, put our new field team we just got somewhere. So where do we really need one? I guess we need a field team in anywhere that has a, sit has a uh, situation, if I recall. So, all right, we get another one that's free... What kind do we want? Credit income, Illyrium income, Intel income. And this one gives less, or, or decreases more unrest. This one gives a little bit less unrest. So uh, unrest each week, unrest after doing situation. We're about to do a situation, but there's also no unrest present. One operation reveal point. No. Oh. Still don't exactly know what that means. Well, let's take it. Maybe that's what we need here, is Operation Reveal Points. So if we do one of those, then it, uh, it helps us actually be able to do that stuff. Oh, man. Unrest is building up over here in Angler's... Angler's Point. Can we do a Vigilance? We can. Let's reduce that. That costs... A cost in anything? Or is that just a... I guess it just has a, uh... A cooldown. Curious if we can do that yet. Not yet. Okay, so let's do this situation here. Bend our. Oh! Okay. Yep, there we go. We get intel. Very good. Got a couple other things. Oh! Alright, so that is still not available, but this one seems to be. Oh, I see. Okay, so what this is, 
is that we have four days until we can do this mission. We have four days until that information is, is revealed. And if we do this, that'll boost it by two days. So we're going to do this one next. That'll be great. Um, let's just check our things here. Okay, Verge is done with his thing there. He's got us some more Illyrium. We maybe do... We need credits. Let's assign you to get us some credits, buddy. And I'm fine keeping Verge over there for now. Let's get a new project going at the assembly. Hmm. We have two people using shotguns, so let's go for enhanced shotgun. Uh, which I guess is just going to give us the ability to purchase those. I don't know if that's like the equivalent of like a laser shotgun or a mag gun or something. Having a level... F having rank 3 assembly teams in each of each type unlocks the assembly projects. The span expand your capabilities at HQ. Oh! Okay, I'm not exactly sure what that means, but let's check it out. So, okay, we got a couple different kinds here. Ooh. Um, let's see if we can upgrade one of them. 80 Intel. Let's upgrade our technology. Well, where do we need one upgraded the most? Probably over here. This, this one's fine. Let's upgrade this one. And yes, let's upgrade them. Okay. And I guess we get a little bit more of all of their bonuses, I suppose. We'll work on upgrading them more as we go. So, we've got a person on a mission. We've got a thing. Let's get all ready to go here to downtown. And locate power spikes. Residents in this district reported a power spike. City workers traced them to an apartment connected to Progeny. Find out what they're up to and put an end to it. All right. Got some nice rewards there. Activities pending. The following HQ activities are currently unaddressed. Scavenger. Oh. Okay, that's good to know. Uh, we can't afford anything because I just spent all of our money on other stuff. Although a grenade would have been. That's all right. Okay. Hostile forces may attempt to guard a mission critical device that needs to be stopped. Destroy the device in question when authorized. Keep your distance if you can. Sounds good. So we are going to move out with our team we have here. We have uh, we have Cherub back with the group. I don't think we have any... Oh, we'll give him extra padding. Yes. And let's make items available. We'll give him... Hmm. Give him the... Flashbang grenade, I suppose. And everyone else has got pretty good. Actually, no. Let's give let's give Cherub the uh, racer. So, all right. Next time, we are moving out to downtown to investigate these power spikes.